Hello everybody, my name is Kimber of Kimber's Cozy Creations and it is Wednesday, June 14th, I believe. Yep, the 14th. And um, if you guys saw my last video, you know I'm doing the Summer Sock Showdown, which is going to be a pre-order for kind of summery sock sets. Um, so yeah, but I had Rachel of Rachel is Knitting, she cranked socks samples for me instead of me like hand knitting all the socks because there's 12 of them. That would be a lot. Um, and I got the package in the mail yesterday. It was right here. So we are going to, I haven't opened it yet. I haven't looked inside. I'm very excited. So I figured we'd kind of look at them together. Um, yeah. And then... I'll just show you what they look like and then I'll go over some more like pre-order pre-order details at the end um, yeah and I'll definitely link Rachel's stuff below she does um, she has an Etsy shop where you can like send her your sock yarn and she will crank them into either tubes or full socks um, which is super super cool because I know I have so many like sock sets and sock yarn skeins that I'm never I mean I'm gonna try to obviously knit them all but there's a lot so she does have that I think right now she has it closed so she can get caught up on orders but she will be opening them opening them back up again so make sure you go follow her on Instagram she has a YouTube channel too go check her out she's an angel I'm so excited about these so let's crack into it like I said I haven't opened it at all so I don't even know I mean, obviously, goodness, hold on, I might have to fast forward this part. There's so much tape on here, which I appreciate, because then it, like, didn't pop open or anything. She just reused the same box. I like that. Might not have been my box, but I no wonder why it was so full. Okay. Oh, that's so fun. So she sent back like all the extra yarn, which is awesome because then I can add it into my like my scrappy blankets, my cozy and memory blankets. So that's super exciting. They're so cute because she, like, the middle of the cake is the main skein and then the minis are around it. So cute. Ooh, hopefully that crinkly. And then we got a big old bag of socks. I'm so excited. Okay, I'm going to open this and dump them out so all the crinkling's done with. So, brace yourselves. Okay, we should be done crinkling now. Okay, so first, they're so cute. So, so excited. We have, this is Hot Mess Express. And, so that she does them with a, like a folded over brim. Um, so it's a double thick brim, so that's cool. And then, um, just looks like a short row heel or the equivalent of on a sock machine. And then just toes. So this is Hot Mess Express. Toes. Super love this one. They are taller than I usually knit my socks, but that's okay, so I'm excited about that. But yes, yeah, so Hot Mess Express, sock set number one, just with one mini color. This is Welcome to the Knit Show. This is Hot Mess Express. It was gonna throw them on the floor, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna treat them nicer than that. Maybe I'm just gonna put one sock on the blocker because that'll go quicker. But both socks are the same, obviously. And then this one is sea glass. Dog. Let's 
see last this is spearmint and then this is aqua they are they are pretty similar but like all this lighting is not doing it any justice either yeah well obviously one's like a minty one's a like a blue yeah this is c-class This is so exciting because then I only have 12 finished pairs of socks and I didn't have to do anything, which is kind of great, not going to lie. Nick, she wove in all the ends. All that goodness. I can't wait to try these on. I'm very excited. And then we have a lily pad. And then this mini is pretty in pink. I do like how lily pad kind of like spirals like the pink you can just see it spiral up that's really cool I say I think I have only seen like two or three of these colorways like actually worked up in socks so this is really exciting for me because now I can see them all we have the lily pad and then we got we have shark bite which was a new one This is Shark Bite. Again, you can kind of see the pooling, uh, spiraling of that one. And this is All Natural. It's just a blank, or a, just bear yarn. Look how pretty. This is Shark Bite. Super excited. I mean, because it's like the gray of the shark. And then the like red blood. That's shark bite. And then we got Judgy Bluebird. This is Judgy Bluebird. Again, it spirals so fun, but it's also kind of variegated. I like the yellow that pops through. This is Cobalt, and this is Peony. This is Judgy Bluebird. So fun. I love Rachel so much. This has saved me so much time. Even just doing, like, little swatches of each one. Like, that would have taken me forever, just because... It's tedious and I have other things I need to be doing. Um, this one is Sand Castle. This one is like the perfect, like neutrally speckle. Like this one would be so good for either like a textured sock or like cables. Because the main skein is obviously kind of basic enough that you're not going to lose the texture. You're not going to lose your cables. But it's still not just a tonal. Um, this is coral, and then this is ocean water. This is sand castle. It's so pretty. This is so much fun. I like this. I almost lost my sock blocker. This one I was very excited to see. Um, this one is mixed berries. This is another brand new colorway. mixed berries this one spirals way more than I thought it was going to but that's totally okay I love it so much and then like it's like a light pink that's in there it's not necessarily white it's just like a light pink this is navy and this is berry berry's been a tried and true tonal I've had for a while navy is a newer one but they work so good with this look at that mixed berries And then we got, yeah, we got Lilac Lemonade. Oh, it is blowing out so much. Like, it is on the lighter side, but it's not as, 
white. Let's see if I can get the... That's a little bit better. Still kind of blowing out though, but there's the purple and yellow kind of micro stripes, but spirals. That's fun. And then this is Jade for the mini. This is a one color mini. So it's Lilac Lemonade. We have four more. There are so many, goodness gracious. Um, this one is Kelp Forest. I am in love with this one. We say this color's been around a little bit, but not really at the same time. Anyway, so it's Kelp Forest. Look at that. It's like all blues and greens and rusty oranges and... So pretty. And the mini is called Sea Otter because they like to play in the kelp forest, so I thought it was fitting. Got a fuzz. Look at that. So good. It's so pretty. So that's kelp forest. And then we got beach bum, which is also a great one. I think they're all great, it's hard to say, but it's beach bum. I'm kind of sandy with the, oh goodness, blue and like aqua and coral. I think on this side, you, like micro stripes and spirals and all sorts of goodness. Um, but this one is aqua and this is coral. I think these are the only two colors that are like repeated in other sock sets, which is totally fine. But like, look at it, beach bum. Maybe I'll go. I need to take pictures of these still for like listings and stuff. Maybe I'll do that later today, and then I'll definitely be putting like the actual picture pictures on Instagram. Cause how can I not? This one is triple foam. I was really excited to see how this one works up and I love it so much. Look at that. Again, this is another one that you could probably do like textured, cabled, because again, it is a variegated, but it is also like low contrast variegated where the stitches aren't gonna get lost, like your texture's not gonna get lost. And this mini is Lavender Haze. Like very pastel-y oh, so good so good and then our last one is pool party which I'm very excited about it look at it i'll show you the other side too because it kind of like here in the like foot, it kind of spiraled a little bit more, but all the blue lined up on that side and like all the pink is on this side for the leg, which is super fun. Yeah, so it's blue, uh, purple, pink. It has some speckles in there. It was like the same color speckles. So they're a little bit more subtle. This is bright berry and this is atomic yellow for the minis. But just look at those. so much fun i am so appreciative of rachel for being like hey yeah i'll do that for you because awesome so that's all of the sock sets um so the pre-order is going up on saturday july july june 17th i don't need to make time go faster than it already is june 17th the pre-orders are going up they will be open for a week or until i reach capacity which i don't entirely anticipate happening um but if it does i will definitely uh make an announcement over on instagram and my stories just being like hey they're gonna close up in 12 hours or 24 hours or whatever um so it'll be open for a week the only so there'll be the sock sets which i just showed you all um on cozy fingering which is what all of these were worked up on 
which is the 75% superwash merino, 25% nylon, four ply, 463 yards to 100 grams, and then twisted fingering, Ugh, got something in my eye, sorry. Twisted fingering, which is a two ply, it is 80% superwash merino, 20% nylon, 400 yards to 100 grams. And then it will also be on Tough DK, which is um, obviously a DK base, four ply, 75% superwash merino, 25% nylon, 245 yards per 100 grams, I believe. I'm gonna double check that. I'm fairly confident it's 245 yards. Yep, 245 yards to 100 grams. Um, so like I said, sock sets will be available. Some of them are two minis, some of them are one minis. All of the minis are 20 grams, even if it's a two mini sock set. Um, I will also have the option for the, like the main color skeins. So basically just a skein of the main color. Because I know some people either don't want minis for sock sets or they just don't Maybe they don't like the colors of the minis, which is totally fine. Um, but then you can get just 100 grams of like pool party or 100, gam 100 grams of just triple foam. Um, so then you can use them for socks or shawls or whatever. I'm not going to be like, hey, are you making socks? No. If you want to get it for a sweater or a shawl or a blanket or whatever, go for it. But it will only be on the three bases for now. Um, and then with that too, I am going to be doing mini sets. Um, here's the, all of the minis together. Um, I believe there's 18 of them, 16 or 18 minis. So I think I'm going to have it where you can get all of the minis together. So it's the 16 or 18 minis together in a set. You will also be able to get 50 gram uh, skeins of all of the tonals together, but you will also be able to order just individual minis. So say you like the pool party sock set, but you also want, I don't know, like Aqua to go with it. So you could get like the sock set and then just get a mini of aqua. Or if you want to like make your own mini set type of thing, that'll be an option. You will also be able to get 100 gram skeins of the tonals on the three bases. So basically, you can get the sock sets, but then you can also get full skeins of all of the color ways. So all the variegated and all the tonals. So you can mix and match, like if, like I said, if you want to make a shawl or a sweater or whatever, I'm not going to police that at all. You do you, whatever. Um, we will also be doing a make along with like these colors from this pre-order. I haven't determined when it's going to start yet because that'll kind of depend on how many orders I get, how quick I can get them out in the mail, because I don't want to start it too early that people don't have their yarn yet, but it'll go long enough that people should have enough time to like make with it. Um, and then it's going to be pretty low key. It's probably just going to be, I'll probably start a thread on my Discord for it, and then like I'll come up with a hashtag on Instagram. I probably won't do a Ravelry group, just, I mean, I have a Ravelry group, but I won't do a thread on that just because it's one, not accessible to everybody. Two, I don't quite understand Ravelry and I don't feel like figuring it out right now. So maybe later. Um, I'm sure there'll be prizes of some sort. Like I said, it's going to be really low key, but I haven't quite figured out all the details yet. But it'll be any of the colorways from this pre-order. Um... I'll probably do different categories, maybe, of like socks versus shawl sweaters. We'll see what happens. Super low key, I'll update you when I know what's going on too, because I don't right now. Um, what else about the pre-order? June 17th for a week. All the options are going to be available. Um, I think that's it. 
Oh, we still, we're still doing the voting. There are, if you include today, so it'll be today, tomorrow, and the day after. There's three days left of voting, including today, to determine which sock set will be on sale during the pre-order. Right now, today's voting is between, um, I'm gonna try to get this up this afternoon, so hopefully there's still enough time to like actually vote if you see this. Um, you can be, you can see it. You can vote either in the community tab here on YouTube or on my Instagram stories. But today's line, matchup, lineup, whatever, is between Lilac Lemonade and Beach Bum. So, whoa. Lilac Lemonade and Beach Bum. These are today's matchups. And then tomorrow is going to be sea glass and mixed berries. I'm really interested to see which one wins of that one. Because so far, the set with the most votes has been sea glass. Um, so here's sea glass and then mixed berries. So this is tomorrow's matchup. And then the day after, so it would be Friday, is going to be a three-way vote between the top, you're like the three that have gotten that far. So, so far it is Hot Mess Express, because that was yesterday's. Um, so this is Hot Mess Express again. So it'll be between Hot Mess Express and then whoever wins today and whoever wins tomorrow. I obviously don't know those yet. Um, but it'll be a three-way vote for the sock set that's on sale on Friday. And then this pre-order starts on Saturday. Um, but yeah, I think that's it. There's a lot going on. It's great. It's so much fun. I'm really excited. Um, let me know in the comments, like, which socks that you're most excited about now that you've seen them worked up. Um, and then let me know if you have any questions, comments, concerns, whatever. I will do my best to respond to it in a timely manner, especially if it is about the pre-order. Um, I'll answer them as quickly as I can. So I think that's it for today. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out and looking at all the beautiful socks that Rachel has cranked for me. Again, I will link all of her stuff below. Um, like I said, she is doing orders for, um, like you can send her your yarn and then she'll crank it either into a tube and you can add your own afterthought socks or afterthought toes and heels and cuffs and all that, or she will like make a completed sock for you. And it was so, it worked out so well because I traced my foot and sent it to her and then she did pretty much the rest of it. So it was great. But I will link all that. Of course it cuts off as I'm doing my outro. Anyways, I'll link all the stuff below, and then I'm excited to see what you guys, like, which one's your favorite, and can't wait to see what y'all order for the pre-order, and yeah, like I said, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, let me know down below, and I will answer them as quickly as I can. So, thanks for stopping by and hanging out, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!